that. Hello, I'm Posey Parker. I run something called Standing for Women. Um, unfortunately, Maria Miller headed up the um, inquiry into whether or not men should be able to identify as women with pretty much no gatekeeping. I just wondered if the Conservative Party would, were absolutely sure what a woman is and whether or not they're aware that the liberal and left policies at the moment and politics are erasing women. So I would like to know that the Conservative Party is absolutely clear in what a woman is. Gosh. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> Would you mind if I put uh, Maria Miller? I'd, uh, that'd be lovely. <laughs> Thank you. Kelly? Well, I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I think, I think that may be a bit mean to put Maria on the spot. She, she just had a very nice lunch. Oh, she may be more qualified to answer it, or we can talk to you later. Okay. So if you, you, you feel passionately about this, I know you I do. do. Um, and I respect you bringing that up. I have to say that within the Conservative Party, um, I'm not sure where, whether we've ever, uh, have we had any trans women yes, in the election? Have we, we have, we have. Have we had them on the list? We have one on the list. And I think what we have to do as um, a party is to understand that the equality law um, affects everybody and that trans women, trans men have just as much right as anybody else to stand for election and I actually rather respect the Conservative Party for having I think one of the first trans women. Sorry my question was do you understand what a, I would like to know what you think a woman is? Let's, let's talk about that later. Ah okay. <laughs> but, we, but we do have two trans, uh, transgender women on the list. Oh what an absolute okay, shame. I've got your chance now. Mm -hmm. to speak to him. Yeah.